One of the most influential figures in off-road motorcycling in the world, John Penton developed a legendary brand of motorcycles that bore his name, better known as the KTM today. He also founded High Point, an accessory and distribution company that had 50% of aftermarket sales in the U.S. and set the mold for modern distribution powerhouses, Parts Unlimited, Tucker Rocky, and Western Power Sports. Even if he hadn't been such a worthy competitor and national champion, John Penton's sheer force of will dictated he'd make a mark on motorcycling. After World War II, he and his brothers opened a shop in their Ohio hometown, from which John started the Meadowlark Motorcycle Club. He set a cross-country record and encouraged the Austrian company that became KTM to develop the revolutionary, lightweight Penton two-stroke dirt bike. His search for better riding gear led him to establish High Point, an accessory and distribution business that set the pace for modern distribution companies. So what is a dirt bike guy doing in the Sturgis Hall of Fame? Well, his brothers learned to ride on a 1917 Harley that belonged to their father. And John began his off-road racing in 1948 on a 61 cubic inch knucklehead. He also rode into national prominence, setting the transcontinental record in 1959 on a street bike, though Penton is justifiably proud of it being just a mud runner, as he calls it. Many consider John to be the godfather of the dirt bike industry, thanks to his game-changing lightweight two-strokes and his shaping and defining of KTM to this very day. John joins William Harley, the Davidson clan, and Sochiro Honda as the only Hall of Famers to have their names emblazoned on their own motorcycle lines. The Hall of Fame's mission is to honor those who have made a positive and significant impact on the sport and lifestyle. It honors the men and women who have dedicated much of their lives to improving, promoting, and advancing motorcycling. Arguably, nobody alive has done more to promote and advance motorcycling than John Penton. His racing and riding feats are the stuff of legends. They don't make them like John Penton anymore. And inducting a living legend like John Penton demonstrates the fact that the Hall of Fame recognizes all aspects of our great sport.